Sonny Battaglia? Keep moving, Jack. Name's Jane. Patrick Jane. I need a moment of your time, if I may. For what? Speak about Eddie Russo. You a cop? <laughs> no. Good. You alone? Yeah. Shoot him. There's three reasons I'm not scared. Well, okay, I'm scared, but there's three reasons I'm not terrified. Please tell. One, you don't get to be your age, rich, and unimprisoned by shooting people willy-nilly on golf courses. Until now. You know what consistency is? The hobgoblin of little minds. Right. Emma's. <laughs> okay, reason number two. I can significantly improve your golf game. You and a hundred other bacalas. Reason number three. I know where to find Eddie Russo. How do I improve my game? Well, it's very simple. It's easy. You have to think of hitting the ball more as uh, an act of creation. What you need is a little more flow. Flow? Mm -hmm. I changed my mind. Shoot him. What's your favorite song? You're the smart ass, you tell me. It's either Elvis Sinatra or Italian opera. Enrico Caruso singing Santa Lucia. Perfect. Could you hand me one of those sticks and we'll get started? Sticks? Whatever you call them. Not the fat one. Get the, the other kind. Okay, well, that's a little fat, but we'll make it work. Flow. Santa Lucia. Santa Lucia, Santa Lucia. I should have shot some myself when you showed up. Santa Lucia. <laughs> All the hours I spent on this course, huh? The thousands I wasted on videotapes and coaching. And Blondie here, he does it with singing. How do you like that, huh? I'm just <laughs> polishing the talent that was already there. Yeah, yeah. So, now tell me, my strange new friend, where's Eddie Russo? You didn't know. Know what? Eddie Russo's dead. No kidding. Killed a couple of days ago. He's in the state morgue in Sacramento under the name of Ed Didrickson. Who did it? You don't know? Interesting. Who did it? I don't know. <laughs> Today <laughs> is a good day. <laughs> good. <laughs> Listen, if you ever find out who killed Eddie, you call me, okay? Because I want to send whoever did it some flowers and a thank you note. Sure, sure. What's your number? What are you doing? Don't give me a number. This guy, what is he gonna do? Hey, it's a clean line, you can talk. Thank you. So if you didn't do it, then who would have done it? Who was next in line? An angry husband, most likely. Eddie was a degenerate skirt hound. Is that right? Mm, an animal, huh. compulsive. So tell me, uh, how was it done? How did they do it to him? Oh, uh, I can assure you, he, he didn't suffer. But thanks for your time, Mr. Battaglia. See you later. Hey, wait a minute. I'm not finished talking with you yet. Well, I'm finished talking with you. <laughs> hey, what, what are you, Al Pacino all of a sudden? People don't act that way with me. I do when there's witnesses around. What are we going to do with this guy? He's got a screw loose. So you think you have a certain outlaw charm about you, and you do. But you live by oppression. In reality, you're just a greedy, twisted little sadist. Hey, screw you, Blondie. You're lucky you helped me beat Arnold Palmer here, huh? Or I'd plug you right now to hell with the witnesses. Screw you.